my brother was in a car wreck. He got pretty banged up. He crushed his leg, mm-hmm. and he's been in the hospital for uh, about a month now. Still can't walk. Um, so now that he's getting a little bit healthier, we're now thinking to, about the legal side of things, and we wanted to know about how you guys go about deciding how much to sue for because I mean in the future he's going to need like wheelchairs and braces and possibly prosthesis and you know a car that can handle a wheelchair or I mean there's so many things he's going to need in the future how do you decide how much he's going to get out of his lawsuit? Right great question first off I'm sorry to hear about Mm -hmm. that that sounds like a very serious serious car accident. Uh, The first thing um, that you probably need to consider, or the first thing that the law looks at, I guess, is um, what are your damages? Uh, Those damages uh, include your harms and losses. So what are your harms? Your medical bills, um, the care that it's going to take to get you through the recovery period, and then the maintenance that it's going to take to move forward in your life. And then, like you said, you may need an a special equipped van or something of that nature. So you have two different types of damages there, whereas uh, you have your current damages uh, and then you have what's called future damages. So how do you come up with that number? Well, you begin to look at what it's going to take. Sometimes you get a uh, licensed healthcare professional involved uh, to opine or to tell us what those future damages may 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 be. Once you get a good handle on that, uh, then you can make a demand to the insurance company and try to settle it. Or, uh, you know, unfortunately, then you may need to go into the lawsuit because those damages are going to may exceed the policy limits of what the other person may have had. So it's a complex answer, uh, but it's an easy answer once you get started into the process with an attorney.